it's almost inconceivable to realize that every nuclear weapon the U.S. has ever had has been designed by one university, the University of California. The University of California manages the nation's primary nuclear weapons labs. Ernest Lawrence and Robert Oppenheimer at UC Berkeley were probably the leading researchers on nuclear physics. Plutonium was actually discovered on the campus. It's really a question of identity. Los Alamos Lab has been the University of California. It's really it's a despicable situation. They're out to create big, powerful universities. Their goal is growth. It's just like a corporation. So for any claims that they make about having run the National Laboratory in the nation's interest is absolute, utter rubbish. They did it because they were paid to do it. In other words, to say it as simply as possible, the University of California could not be more involved in the nuclear weapons enterprise. When we started the campaign, we believed that if students found out about this, that their university was involved with making nuclear weapons, that they would want to react to that and protest it. Y'all ready? It does not make sense for a university to manage nuclear weapons labs. I think it's one of the most immoral and unethical institutions in the country. We don't want bombs. A group of protesters interrupted a University of California Board of Regents meeting to demand the school sever ties with the nation's nuclear weapons program. It's time that you put principles before profits. I, I'm very embarrassed to, to be receiving a diploma from the university whose slogan is let there be light, but that is a light of nuclear holocaust. These are serious issues, but our 30 minutes have come to an end. But if you want to leave now, feel free to leave. Lawful assembly, if you remain, you'll be uh, subject to arrest. I don't think any university should tolerate being involved in uh, weapons research. Oh, 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 oh.